Hello everybody. Making another uh, all natural fertilizer. And I will be using, now keep in mind, I've watched videos how to do this. Very simple, all natural. Um, it's called Jadam Liquid Fertilizer, all natural. Um, they did say in the video that I was watching that that person wasn't the first person to come up with it, but that's what this is called. Very simple and easy, okay? Um, what you're going to do is we're going to use the five gallon bucket and it's all the first uh, grass clippings, okay? So we filled it halfway with the wild grass clippings which means it's never been fertilized and it's not been cut. So, uh, you know, like prior. So Lee whacked it off for me so I could collect it all up on part of our property that doesn't, norm, doesn't get, it, he hadn't mowed or anything this year on that whole section. So that was great. I told him not to clip anything off of that area till I was ready and I needed it. So it is the bu five gallon bucket is filled halfway with the wild grass clippings. So this is your first grass clippings because it is more potent and full of good stuff. Now, yes, the video said what kind of good stuff. I can't remember all of the good stuff. I wrote down good stuff. So we're going to toss in a handful of leaf mold. Um, it's like uh, if you hold both of your hands together, but since I'm holding the phone, this is the leaf mold. I'm going to put two scoops because it's like one hand and then the other hand would be holding. I'm going to throw that in. It's okay if there's roots or leaves or whatever. It's leaf mold. Okay. Then we're going to um, top. Let's see here. Then we're going to top it off with rainwater, and we're going to let this sit for three weeks minimum. Don't use it before three weeks. You can use it, well, technically you can use it after two weeks. Three weeks is better and on. But the longer it sits, the better it is. But if you're needing it in two weeks, it's okay. Go ahead and use it. I myself am going to wait probably for three weeks. Um, now, the way you use this, I'm going to top it off with water. You do not um, use it straight out of the bucket. It is way too strong. And when I say way too strong, I mean way too strong. How you're going to dilute it to use it, you're going to use one cup of this fertilized fertilizer liquid to 50 cups of water that's that's 3.13 gallons okay so you're going to dilute it to use it for your plants you're going to use one cup of this to 50 cups of water that's how much you're going to dilute this okay we're gonna take it, the bucket over there, and top it off with the rainwater. And this, um, like I say, it's all natural and got a lot of good, potent, good stuff in it. So let's take it over here and fill it with water and stir it up. Let me go ahead and move the bed because I'm just going to leave that sitting right there and I've already written on the lid what it's going to be I'm going to hang on my phone so I don't drop it in the water so we're going to drop it off for some of you that's not watched my other videos I do have a video on the leaf mold. In case you don't know what it is, um, you can watch the video and see me talking about it and actually forging 
collecting it. It's gonna rain today, so. We can get more rainwater. These bu this bucket's one I'm always trying to use, but I took out Lee's two, uh, <laughs> two bins that he had in his worm farm for in the event that he gets more worms than one can hold. He's got more, but right now, since he hasn't made any holes or anything in it, I'm going to be using it. I've got my stick here. We are going to stir it up really really good I'm gonna eventually get me a better stick this just happened to have been uh, kind of in the spot that I was looking for a stick and I just kind of grabbed it I need to switch my hands though to my hand, move it away from there. Okay. Let's do it. Good. Remember, this is the first grass clippings of the year. So it's full of its good stuff. And then it's got the leaf mold in it. We're going to put the lid on it, seal it up really good, and not use it for three weeks. The longer it sits, the better. If you just have to use it in two weeks, you can, not before, but try to, to wait to hold off. As the water, as you use it, and the water works down, you can re- Fill it up again. Okay. Now, this on it. These buckets are heavy for this old lady to tote around, so it'll sit here till I decide where else I want it. I want it in the sun. And that one is down, and I'll have him move it. I'm going to go ahead and leave this lid off of the rain barrel. Uh, it's going to rain today. That way I can collect rain. We'll leave this one here for rain. Um, and we got these to collect rain. Thank you.